This episode of Techno Buffalo is brought to you by GoDaddy. What's up, everyone? John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo here. Last week, we had a battle of digital assistants. We had Apple Siri squaring up against Microsoft's Cortana. The logical continuation of that is to show you how Google now stacks up against Microsoft's latest. Let's go ahead and put these two head to head and see which one you think comes out on top. So the usual caveats here are going to apply. Cortana is still very clearly in beta, and beyond that, it's running on a beta OS in Windows Phone 8.1, so take that for what you will. Uh, on the left, of course, we've got Google Now running on an at and version of the HTC One M8. So I'm gonna ask exactly the same questions that I did when I compared Siri versus Cortana, so you can see how both would compare. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. And usually when I've done these, I've hit them both at the same time to see which one comes up quicker, uh, but I'm gonna go one than the other, because I want you to be able to hear what the phones say and how quickly they say it. What's the weather outside? It's 86 degrees and partly cloudy in Irvine. And Cortana could launch either by hitting the search button or just the icon if you've got it there. What's the weather outside? It's currently 85 and clear. So you see a difference there in how the uh, information is shown. You got the grayscale or the black and white scale rather, uh, and sort of the Google card look um, on Google Now. Let's go for some sports questions. Who won the Angels game? So that took me to the web. You sometimes it'll show you the actual score though. Who won the Angels game? On Monday. The Los Angeles Angels defeated the Cleveland Indians 6-3. That they did. Set an alarm for 30 minutes. Setting alarm for 12.03 p.m. So you can wait for that blue bar to go all the way to the end, or you can just hit set alarm. That's how that works. Set alarm for 30 minutes. All right. Your alarm is set for 12.03 p.m. Very quick. Let's do some reminders. Remind me to buy milk. So it'll pick when and where. And I should also say that both these are connected to the same Wi-Fi networks uh, here at the office. Remind me to buy milk. When do you want to be reminded? Tomorrow. Sure thing. At what time? So both of them ask the same questions, what day and what time. Uh, Google Now does it with text and Siri, uh, Siri rather not Cortana rather, uh, does it with voice, not Siri, of course. All right, next, let's try opening applications. Launch Chrome. Opening app. I'm gonna go and launch Chrome. Launch Internet Explorer. All right. Starting Internet Explorer. So go ahead and launch Internet Explorer. Now, what about if you want to go to a website? So let's try that. Go to technobuffalo.com. Opening web page. So that'll go and open the web page. Wait till that blue bar goes across or just select it. Go to technobuffalo.com. So that pulls up a Bing search. You can select it right from there. Uh, let's ask it some sports questions. How old is Kobe Bryant? Kobe Bryant is 35 years old. How old is Kobe Bryant? Kobe Bryant is 35 years old. Kobe. Let's try movie times. Show me movie times for Captain America. So that just launched the web and you can sort of see some uh, times quickly show up uh, down below. Show me movie times for Captain America. Same thing with uh, a web search there. We take a quick step away from the battle here for a minute to thank our friends and overall good peeps at GoDaddy. 
It's go time and GoDaddy is here to help you kick butt online. Start your website today with a $2.95.com. Check out GoDaddy.com. Enter promo code TECHNO295, no spaces, to get your .com for just $2.95. Check out the website, though, for some limitations. If you ever want to start a blog or create your brand new site, now is the chance. Again, use the code TECHNO295. What is the national animal of Scotland? Scotland's national animal is the unicorn. <laughs> what is the national animal of Scotland? Unicorn. Show me pictures of buffaloes. Pictures of buffaloes. Here you go. Show me pictures of buffaloes. So those are the 10 questions that I wanted to show, but just for fun, let's do one more. Tell me a joke. Tell me a joke. Why didn't the spider go to school? Because she learned everything on the web. So it shows a bit of personality that Cortana has. So what do you guys think? Uh, certainly, uh, Google Now, I think, is the creme de la creme of digital assistants. Uh, but, but Cortana, while still kind of late to the game and still in beta, is really, really good. So don't really, can't really decide which one's best and which one's going to work the best in the future. But I did want to show that Cortana, despite being new, is really up to par with the best digital assistant going right now. So I think Microsoft did a really nice job. Uh, but, you know, what do you guys think? So what do you guys think about Google Now versus Cortana? Certainly Cortana is still in beta, but it's a pretty strong showing for a beta product. Love to hear your thoughts. Well, maybe this helps you determine which phone you want to get. Maybe you look differently at Windows Phone or no way you are solely only looking at Google. Love to hear your guys' thoughts on it. Please leave the comments located right down below. Until then, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. What's up, everyone? Thank you for watching that video. If you want to see more of the latest and greatest tech news, you can subscribe to our main Techno Buffalo channel by clicking the button right down below in my pants region, or click on the buttons to your right to see more videos.